you already know these brows period I'm the way. hey babes welcome back to my channel it's your girl D'Angela and we are back at it again with another video today we are going to be getting into how I get these bomb brows. I've been getting this question a lot lately on what is my brow routine. So of course, I had to go ahead and record a full video and drop it from a girl, period. So without further ado, let's jump right on into it. So let's get right into these brows. The first thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and take my eyebrow razor and I'm just gonna shape up my brows, not too much. I don't wanna alter them. I just wanna kinda clean up that excess hair that's growing in. Cause cleaning your brows up with concealer and that hair sticking out, it's just like so tacky to me. Now I'm just taking a disposable um, wand I like these just because of the fact that I could just kind of brush the glue through and, you know, throw it away. And I don't have to worry about getting glue out of my, my bristles. So now I'm just taking the Kiss um, Lash Glue. And this is what I use to lay my eyebrows hairs down with. You can either use lash glue, hair gel, um, brow soap. Like, they have a lot of ways to lay your brows down. I just prefer the lash glue. This is the method that I have been doing. That piece of glitter on my brow, it was kind of really irritating me when, while watching this, but I mean, hey, it is what it is now. So as you can see, those brows are snatched into that eyebrow bone, okay? So now I'm just taking a Q-tip with um, some alcohol on it, and we're just gonna clean up those brows. Now we are going to be taking our crayon case eyebrow pomade in dark brown and the brush that i use to do my eyebrows i have been using this brush for years is um the anastasia beverly hills brush number 12. and to do my brows i'm literally going in like really thin strokes i don't just draw one line that is extremely tacky your eyebrows are gonna look so dark and really like fake Now that we have our brows outlined, I'm going to take the tip, the pointiest part of the angle brush, and I'm going to start drawing thin, thin, thin hair-like strokes. Think about your hair strokes, and then that is how thin I want you to draw those lines. And this is just to really fill in those gaps without making the brow look really, really dark. Like, we don't want a dark brow. You want it to look really nice really natural, really simple. Now that we have those brows drawn on, now it is time to conceal them. And this is literally my favorite part, but it is the most tedious part as well. I am using my P. Louise base for the underbrow, I'm using five. And then for the top of the brow, I'm using seven. And then the brush is also a P. Louise brush as well. And you can find the links to all of these products down in my description bar below. But I'm taking literally the tip of the brush and I'm going in really, really soft, really, really soft and really, really slow to outline that brow and then you don't want to leave that concealer in one spot you want to drag it down like you want to drag it in the opposite direction of your brow whether it's down or up and to shape out the top of my brow i like to go straight across first and then go and focus on the arch you whether you want it to be really really arched really really straight you know however you like to tell your brow to look do you now I'm going to take this brush from Way Too Pretty Cosmetics to blend out that concealer on the top of my brow. And then I'm going to be taking my Morphe M173 brush to blend out that under brow and drag that base down to my eyelids. And then after I finish up my eyebrows, I'm going to take that same um, Morphe 173 brush and use it to diffuse the front of my eyebrows 
you don't put any concealer on the brush or anything like that just kind of like tap it across the front to get rid of all of those harsh boxy lines this completes this eyebrow tutorial i hope you guys learned something new today let me know in the comment section below what you would like to see next for me and i'll see you guys in my next video